Uh, and now we're gonna jump onto the mobile device. Yep. And again, it's the same user. Yep. I'm trying to access a lot of the same things. Yep. Uh, this device has already been provisioned and that was a simple two steps. Um, I basically go to the registration page. I put in my uh, username yep. and password and it starts registering. I don't have to call IT. I don't have to do any of that stuff. Okay. Right? So the end user flow, again, the one thing we want is options and we want simplicity. That's right. For the end user, all they do is they use their um, device as normal. Yep. So I know I'm gonna wanna use um, Opera to access my internal website. One of the things you'll notice is up in the corner, it's uh, spinning now, it's saying VPN. So if I go ahead and click on uh, my intranet site, yep. I got to it. Okay. And, and this was uh, because we provisioned this device to use um, the VPN. Okay. If I use something else like, uh, if I go to Safari, which isn't a managed app, and I try to access it, it doesn't find it, it doesn't use the VPN. If we go uh, back to this app, you can see right when I clicked on it, it took me to um, a, the VPN launched again. I'm gonna say log in. I'm gonna say use single sign-on. I'm gonna put in my email. And this is, again, it's gonna use the same gateway. Yep. And I don't have to worry about having multiple gateways or teaching my end user uh, how to connect to different things. It uses single gateway, no matter how you connect. It doesn't matter what role you are, if you're a customer, if you're a partner, yep. uh, if you're a contractor, one gateway is all we have to manage. And that's the only thing that people have to know uh, how to connect to.